Hello and welcome back to another Marvel Champions two-handed play. Today we are having gonna have an epic showdown with Mysterio with facing off against Gambit and Psylocke. Now I've been wanting to play Psylocke in a multiplayer game just because I think that she uh she she can do some cool things with the skill cards, and we'll talk about the deck build here in a second, but just gonna shuffle this up. Master or not Master Mold, Mysterio is having Kang, Master of Time, uh hang out with him today, and that's who he's teaming up with, along with the personal nightmare, which is the required mod set for Mysterio. We've got our two shifting apparitions engaged with us, and we're going to go ahead and start here. Mysterio. Uh, actually, we'll go through the deck first. We got an ally liner. We got Machine Man, Deadpool, Dazzler, Blindfold, X. And then we got Cerebro here to tutor mainly X or Blindfold. I'll talk. We'll, we'll, we'll talk about uh, why we may want to be bringing Blindfold in a little bit more once we take a look at. Oh, actually, he's right here. Cosmo. It. It. That was they ruined the surprise. It's Cosmo. Cosmo works well with blindfold. We got two copies of Crisis Averted. We've got two copies of Overwatch to trigger off of that. We've got two copies of Upside the Head. I plan on confusing Mysterio fairly frequently here, and then utilizing our float like a butterfly and bringing two of these, one for each character for Mysterio. But then if we can also Upside the Head and stun him, we're gonna be feeling pretty good about ourselves. We got two copies of Skilled Investigator to pass out. And under surveillance, a sidearm. Now, the sidearm is probably going to be here for Deadpool. And the sidearm is really here just in case Remy, who's running lock and load, allows us to go get a weapon. Just in case Scimitar is already out, we have another target. We got superpower training and build support. We got X Bunker. We got a side holster for the scimitar and then doubles and power of the mind to start us out. So kind of a ally heavy work on the work manage some sort of threat but really kind of the idea is to make sure that we can um make sure that we can get uh mysterio confused so that we can trigger those float like a butterfly attacks where those instances deal plus one damage gambit has a couple of cards that deal multiple instances of damage and so that's kind of why i wanted to pair him up with betsy so we'll see how that goes let's go ahead and shuffle the top card in here because mysterio says when revealed in player order shuffle the top card of the encounter deck into each player's deck then after you resolve a boost card during mysterio's activation if it has the illusion trait we have to place it on the bottom of our deck and the whole thing here is that mysterio is going to be adding cards into our deck and whenever we would draw or discard them instead we deal them to ourselves as a face out encounter card it's nasty Alrighty, our, our ally lineup over here for gambit is cosmo good old boy both Remy and Blindfold can take a look at that deck, and so the idea is to have Cosmo sit out here for as long as we can. We're going to give him one of those sweet energy spirits as well as an enraged. So once he has float, once he has, I'll just go ahead and ruin the surprise here, once he has boot camp, we brought boot camps for everybody, he is attacking for seven, right? So two, four, five, six, seven. Good boy. We got Professor X to help with Confuse, Magic, Sunfire, Spider-Girl, and Wolverine. We've got two copies of Enraged just to kind of pass out um, to, to, to people. Enraged, probably over here on Cosmo, could also go on Deadpool. We got two copies of Clobber, two copies of One by One, two copies of Melee, a Lock and Load. Lock and Load is probably going to grab maybe the Staff or an Energy Spear. We got Moira, X Jet, two aggressive energies, and the doubles to round out Remy's kit. We're going to take our top card here, shuffle it into the deck. And yeah, we start the game with two shifting apparitions, which is wonderful. Love those things. They are probably my favorite things out there. Uh, <laughs> uh, and yeah, I think that kind of does it for the setup. We got nine health over here on Remy and 10 on Betsy. We're starting with the two knives. Let's go ahead and see what the molly or what our uh, what our first hand looks like. That's superpower training. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. We got genius, mental detection, power of the mind. One, two, three, four. Skilled investigator. Nice. And X bunker. Nice. 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 
So we got two, four, six. I really like it. I really, really like it here. So we got a power of the mind, which can play mental detection, which can clear the superpower training. We got a genius to play X bunker and a skilled investigator to give Betsy. I, I'm good with it. I, I'm good with it. I think that's pretty good. Uh, sweet. Alrighty, we're gonna we're gonna hang on to that. Not to a mulligan. Love it. Gambit's got a Moira. Beautiful charge card. The X Jet. We'll probably pass on the X Jet just because build support can grab X Jet. Creole Charmer. Royal Flush. We got two, four, five. Cosmo is our six. Nice. Alrighty. We're going to toss Royal Flush. We're going to toss X Jet. Toss charge card. We're going to keep Moira. We could probably, honestly. We'll Creole, we'll Creole Charmer. We will Creole Charmer. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. We're going to keep Creole Charmer. We're going to keep Cosmo. We actually may not keep Cosmo. We'll keep Cosmo. We'll see what happens, at least. We've got another Creole Charmer. Spider Girl. And a clobber. Nice. Betsy is going to start us out. We have nothing to do here in Alter Ego. And so we are going to go ahead and flip to Psylocke. We'll use a Psy Knife. And we'll go ahead and flip that to the Katana side. So we'll get a plus one, plus one. Yes. Yes. Um... Ooh, actually, actually. <laughs> First, we're going to take up the Shifting Apparition when we have a one attack. Now we're going to Psy Knife to play Superpower Training. The Psy Knife will trigger the response to flip this over to the Katana. Then we're going to use Power of the Mind to play Mental Detection. So remove one threat from a scheme. And then for each side, knife, remove two additional. So this is going to have three, which is what we call the perfect amount for if there was a Creole Charmer at the table. Then for each Katana, we get to draw a card, which is Scimitar. Let's go. All righty. I think Scimitar is better than Skilled Investigator here. Yeah. Okay, let's use a Genius to play X Bunker. Let's use Psy Knife and Skilled Investigator to play Scimitar. I'm going to set this here just because I have a hard time remembering if I have those three restricted cards. And until we get our side holster, this is actually very precarious. And so we need to just be careful there. Um, perfect. Remy over here is going to call... Well, actually, I guess it's his turn. We're going to use Clobber Creole Charmer for a Creole Charmer. We'll remove three threat from Superpower Training, which is going to put it into the Victory Display. We're going to count number of side schemes and Victory Display right here. Um, and then we get to go find a upgrade. A hero-specific upgrade. We're going to go find our weapons training. Perfect. Over here for Psylocke. Also, while we're here, let's see what cards in our deck because we do get to look through our deck now. Did I shuffle a card into this deck? Oh, oh shoot, it's Kang. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Uh, it actually is kind of fun because we could pull Ancient Grudge and not search player decks. You search encounter decks and encounter deck discard pile. So that could be kind of fun. Um, hopefully, we don't get him anytime soon. And Gambit. Gets a, uh, he has an induced panic, which is not too bad. A hero specific upgrade. Oh my gosh, what did I do to this deck? Ah, it's so sad. It's, it's all over the place. Okay, it looks like all of them are shifted. Oh my goodness. We are actually going to go ahead and grab... Our staff. We're going to put our staff onto the table. So when an enemy attacks, because the staff can take care of the shifting apparition. Also, the Creole Charmer. Remove the last start. So we're going to be confusing Mysterio. We actually may 
not roll up with Remy. We may stay down. We do have... Eh. Okay, let's go ahead and X Bunker to draw a card over here. We got Molecular Acceleration. We are, uh, we're going to go ahead and we'll use Molecular Acceleration to play Moira. We don't get the charge counter because that's a hero response, but we'll go ahead and flip up. Trigger Moira to draw a card, which is a Clobber. We'll take a Spider Girl and a Clobber to play a Cosmo. When Cosmo attacks the Thwart, name the card type, then discard the top card of a deck. We're going to go ahead and name Treachery and attack here. It is a Treachery, so no Consequential, and the Shifting Operation goes away. Uh, what would have been smart is if I had done my ability, but I didn't do that. Here we are. We'll go ahead and attack for two. Because that's the whole point of this deck, is putting Cosmo out and letting him know what's on the top of the deck using Remy's ability or through blindfold activation so that we can always have Cosmo, the good old boy, out and ready to go. Alrighty. Psylocke gets four cards. We've got Martial Arts Training, Upside the Head, Psionic Redirect, and a Crisis Averted. Then Gambit's got five cards. We've got Boot Camp. Let's go. Charge card. Oh, speaking of, I charged the card. Gambit Guild Armor. Nice. Royal Flush, Thieves Guild, two, four, five. All righty. We're going to add two thread here. Mysterio is going to attack Psylocke for two plus a boost card. We'll take it right to the face, plus two. So that's going to be four. It is not an illusion card. And then we got him attacking Gambit. We'll take it right to the face. It's going to be two plus one. It is an illusion card, so it goes on the bottom of our deck. So that's going to be three damage to Gambit. And counter cards get dealt out. Psylocke has got a time display soldier. This insights one and surges. Surges into a humongous hallucination. Spin one resource of any type. Shuffle the top two cards of the encounter deck into your deck to discard this plus three. This is why we have Sunfire in the deck. Now I really want a Sunfire. Gambit has got a evil doppelganger. Evil Doppelganger gets plus X to her scheme and attack, where X is the number of identity-specific cards in the engaged player's hand. Alrighty. This is going to pass over to Gambit. We've got... Hmm. Oh, sorry about that. What does Psylocke have going on? We have, ooh, we have a Crisis Averted, which is going to be hard to not play. Um, any Psionic cards that we want to shuffle in? Mental Detection could be nice to shuffle in. I think Psylocke's going to go home this turn. and Or flip down to Alter Ego. But we have this... We have a Time Display Soldier and an Evil Doppelganger that we need to take care of. Let's go ahead and we're going to use charge card, Gambit's Guild Armor, and Royal Flush to play Boot Camp over here on uh, Gambit. We get a charge counter here. We have the Thieves Guild. We're going to hang on to that, I think. Let's go ahead and have Cosmo. We'll name Treachery again. It is a Treachery, and it's Shadow of the Past, which is nice. So we got two damage here. Gambit's going to deal two damage. And then we have the Gambit Staff, which is an Interrupt, which can kill here. Okay. Over here. We don't have any Psionic cards that we want to shuffle in. So we're going to use both of our... Um, resource generators here, and we're gonna we're not gonna flip to the katana because we lose our scimitar if we do that. We're also going to play psionic redirect to play crisis averted to remove six threat from this main. Boom. Put that down at one. Treasure. 
trying to figure out if there is a good way to take out this time display soldier. I don't think there really is. I think I'd rather heal. So let's flip down. We'll heal for three. We will X bunker to draw a card, which is an energy. Eh. We will go ahead and use upside the head to play martial arts training and hang on to the energy, which will end us end out the round. Let's go ahead and stand up. We're going to hang on to the energy. Oh, and we got Kang coming. We got Thieves Guild. I'm listening to like the Spotify DJ. And he just said, here's a playlist of things that you typically like to listen to on Thursdays. Okay, crazy. Thieves Guild. Oh my goodness. Um, We're going to keep it. We got Wolverine. Oh, nice. Magic. Aggressive energy. Two, four. And lock and load. All righty. Psylocke is going to get a... She has energy. Crisis averted. Kang. <laughs> Upside the head. Psionic redirect. Training regimen. Beautiful. Two, four, five. And a strength. Oh, we're going to get a float like a butterfly. We're going to add two thread here to the main. Mysterio is going to attack Gambit. We are going to go ahead and defend with Gambit. So Mysterio is attacking for five to... I forgot he had that humongous hallucination thing. Yep. Uh, so five. We're defending for three. Plus two. Draw three cards. Discard three random cards from your hand. So that's seven. Oh, geez. Okay. So... Boost happens first. Draw three. Rogue. Natural agility. Oh, no. And then we're going to discard three random cards from our hand. Lock and load. Thieves guild. And aggressive energy. Alrighty. Not too bad. So he attacked for seven total. We take four damage. We're down to one health. That could be very bad very quickly. Alrighty. Then we will Gambit Staff the Evil Doppelganger here. Yikes. Mysterio is going to scheme. Time to play Soldier is going to put one. We're going to deal out Encounter Guards. Okay. We got Induced Panic. You cannot resolve uh, triggered abilities in your hero's printed text box. Uh, alter Ego Action. Discard one identity specific card at random from your hand. Okay. And then we've got a Fearmonger Surge. Discard your hand. Drop to your hand size. That's a little sad. Rogue is... Well, I guess we weren't going to be able... Eh. Enraged would have been nice to have, but we got five cards. Molecular Acceleration. I'll take it. Melee. Ooh. One by one. Enraged. Perfect. Two, four. And an energy. Nice. Okay. Little bit too many resources, honestly, but we may be able to draw into something better. Um, Betsy <gasps> Kang, ah, toughness and villainous. Then we've got a light of century sphere when defeated, discard cards from the top of the encounter deck until a minion is discarded. Put that minion into play, engage with the player defeated this scheme. It comes in with six, two, four, five. Six. All right, we'll pass this over to Betsy. And Okay. I'm trying to trying to figure out because we have X bunker which we can draw a card. We are looking at a melee. We could just drop enraged on Cosmo. We have a melee to clear time display soldier and Mysterio. We have to discard one identity specific card at random from our hand. So we're not going to be able to. I don't want to do that with the molecular acceleration. I'd rather have the charge counter. So. With that, 
Let's give the card draw here to mental detection. It's actually pretty great. Cool. We will use a psionic redirect to play a training regimen. I'll stack that with X bunker. We will exhaust to go find a skill card, which can be float like a butterfly. All right, we got flow like a butterfly now. We will flip up to Psylocke. Let's use a... Let's use a string to play a mental detection. So we're going to remove one threat plus two for the knife. We're going to take that off of here. We get to draw a card, which is blind. Ooh, which is blindfold. Now we're kind of, we're, 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 we're interested. We'll scimitar here to. What do we want to throw this damage? We have piercing. Melee takes out time display soldier easily. I think we throw it here. Throw two damage at Kang. We'll use katana and knife and to play float like a butterfly. I'm going to play float like a butterfly over here on gambit first. Then we're going to use energy crisis averted to play blindfold after she enters play we get to look at the top five cards two three four five discard one of these these are going to be boost because i don't think we're actually confusing so this is going to be a boost for an attack boost for a scheme and counter card and counter card fool's paradise is scary to me i don't like fool's paradise it we do have crisis averted so we can get around the crisis but Fool's Paradise is a scary, scary card. Let's go ahead and... Uh, ooh, actually, we may toss the gang up. Well, we're going to toss another one as well. So we could go... Under Fire is top. We have Masterful Mirage. That's fine. Okay, we'll toss the gang up. Let's go ahead and have, oh my goodness, I don't like it. Psylocke and Blindfold take out here. Oh wait, no, that's not good. Because then we, we discard until we get a minion and we don't know what's happening. Uh, we'll have them clear here. All right. We have an upside the head. But we're good, we're good. Okay, let's use a molecular acceleration and a one by one to play melee. We're going to leave the threat here. We're actually going to attack Matt Kang and deal two damage because we have piercing. Cosmo with an Enraged is attacking for four, so that's enough to clear Master of Time. So we're going to use the one by one and Molecular Acceleration. And then we, oh wait, we cannot get the, we cannot use Charge the card right now because of Induced Panic to play Melee, which is going to hit Time Display Soldier and three damage here. Okay. We're using Energy to. Oh, I forgot to Moira over there for Psylocke. Aha. Two-handed plays are hard. We're going to name Treachery and kill Kang. We will flip down to Alter Ego and hide. Let's go ahead and stand up. Psylocke. 
we're gonna keep the upside the head. Are we? Are we? No, we'll toss upside the head. We've got side holster that makes me feel a lot more comfortable. Under surveillance, uh, psionic training, and an Overwatch. Then we've got six cards over here. We got a boot camp. Natural agility. Of course, I always draw that when I'm in alter ego. A strength. X. Nice. Genius. Two, four, five. And a melee. Oh, sweet. We can we can discard natural agility for induced panic. Perfect. Alrighty, we got two here. Asterio is going to attack us for a significant amount. So it's going to be three, six, eight. We're going to toss blindfold in front of that truck. Okay. I think I want blindfold. I think I want Psylocke to be flipping down. I guess it really doesn't matter. Never mind. And then Mysterio is going to be scheming for two plus two is four. Up to eight on the main. We're going to be dealing out in counter cards. We got one, one, one. This is Masterful Mirage. Whenever you would deal any amount of damage to Mysterio, discard the top four cards of your deck instead, then discard the card. We got an advance. So we're going to be scheming for two plus two is four. So two, four, six plus four is 10. So we're at 12 out of eight. And then Gambit is caught off guard. Discard an upgrade or support you control. We're going to toss Enraged. Because I think I have another Enraged coming. I know we've seen at least two of them. Yeah, so we have another Enraged coming. Okay, that was not too bad. We're going to swap this over here. We're going to discard Natural Agility to clear Induced Panic. Let's go ahead and use our ability. We're going to target... Light at the light of century sphere. So look at the top two. So deja vu is a reveal this card. Um, we got. Hmm. Oh, wait, hold on. No, we'll go two here because we're going to discard the Deja Vu. I don't know why I'm having a hard time with the timing here. <laughs> um, sweet. Okay. So now we know Deja Vu is on the top. I should have healed instead. That was a bad call. That was a really bad call. I did not think the, about the fact that I have one health. That is on me. That is absolutely on me. What we may do is we may both go to Alter Ego. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. Um, yikes. That was bad. That was really bad. Let's go X Bunker to draw Remy into a one by one. Okay. Strength and one by one. We'll play Professor X. We do have a blocker. That's so scary. Okay. Professor X will confuse Mysterio. We will flip to hero form. Grab a charge counter. Moira will draw us a card. Into an enraged. It's back. It's back. Um, we'll use Genius and Melee to play boot camp over here with Psylocke. X will go ahead and take three here so this is going to go down to nine cosmo will name treachery and clear this we'll discard until we get a minion time to display soldier in sight one and i think we're actually putting it into play which surge does not trigger then but the i think well i actually don't even know i don't think insight surges or insight procs we go to our handy dandy Cerebro on the Discord. Here's a plug. You should definitely join the Discord. It's a good time. We have a bot that tells us all the rules. I am in sight. 
insight C I T E <laughs> C I T E insight when a card is revealed so nope we don't even have to reveal that so that's nice Okay. All right, we're going to hang on to the Enraged just because that's fun for Cosmo. We'll go over here and look at Psylocke. We're going to go ahead and play a side holster so we can throw Scimitar here and be a little bit safer with that. Um... Side knife katana will play under surveillance onto the main, and then we will we'll go ahead and attack two here, knowing that we have a gambit staff to clear. We'll flip down. We'll go find float like a butterfly with training regiment. Then we'll use Overwatch and Psionic Training to play Float Like a Butterfly over here on Betsy. Alrighty. Risky, risky, risky. You gotta love it, right? Um, okay, let's stand up. Gambit, we're gonna hang on to Enraged. We've got Sunfire. Oh, beautiful. I'm going to place this here because it's just to make sure. Energy Spear also for Cosmo. Let's go. Charge card and a aggressive energy. Two, four, five. Nice. Then Betsy is going to get a Flurry of Blades. Angel. Flurry of Blades. Skilled Investigator. Flurry of Blades. Jeez. Two, four, five. And a Mental Detection. I'm going to add two thread here. So we're going to go up to 11. Mysterio is going to attack. We're going to block with Professor X. He's going to attack for five, six. It's going to knock Professor X out to the next dimension. And then we've got a time display soldier, which we will game at staff to take him out. Looking over here at Betsy, we're confused. And we're going to pass out some cards. Gambit. Another Masterful Mirage. Okay. Betsy has got a Ancient Grudge. Kang activates against you. If he's not in play, search the encounter deck and discard pile for Kang. We'll bring him back. Cool. Pass this over here to Betsy. go find a skilled investigator or a skill card i guess oh ah we're out oh that's so sad it's so sad when we're out of skill cards oh well um okay so i think we're gonna give the card draw here to overwatch Okay. We don't have Cerebro yet. Cerebro is such man, I, I miss Cerebro. Um do we have do we have X? We don't. Let's go ahead and side knife and shuffle blindfold back into our deck. Just so that we have blindfold ready for a cosmo pull. Okay. We will flip up to Psylocke. Kang Master of Time. Okay. Ah, oh, 
stupid masterful mirages. Um, I assume only one of those gets hit each time. Which is actually fine. Which is actually kind of fine. Go Psychotana, Overwatch, um, and Flurry to play Flurry. So deal two damage to an enemy for each side. Knife you control. Confuse it. So we're going to confuse Mysterio. And then deal two damage. So each time that damage is going to be prevented, discard eight cards of our deck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Shouldn't math. Uh, stupid. <laughs> um, okay. We are going to go ahead and attack. We are going to interrupt and switch this into Psychotana and attack King for piercing three. And we are okay. Oh, also, Scimitar is going to not respond, actually. Okay. We are going to trigger. No, it is going to trigger. Scimitar is going to hit Mysterio for actually uh, three because we have float like a butterfly. I'm going to trigger weapons training to uh, ready each weapon that we control. Cool. We'll go katana, katana, I'm going to have set. I can't. I, I need to be careful. I need to remember Moira. That's on me. That's on me. Uh, Katana, Katana, and a Angel will play Flurry of Blades. So each instance of damage gets increased. So it's going to be 369. Down to 15 on Mysterio. Uh, Scimitar will I'll hit him for three here. No. Scimitar will... Yeah, we'll hit him for three. No, yeah, three. Three through three. We'll play a skilled investigator over here on Psylocke. Okay. Gambit is going to get a charge counter. And I remember that this time. I'm going to use Aggressive Energy and Charge Card to play Sunfire. After you play Sunfire, we are going to spend a Energy Spear to get rid of this attachment. Sunfire is going to attack and take out Kang. Attack him for three. We have Enraged. We hang on to it again. We'll flip down and heal this time. Or remember to do that because that seems to be important. Okay. We're not going to risk Cosmo at this point. Let's stand up, stand up, stand up. There's so many cards coming in at our, coming in our way, coming in at us. We're at 11 here. He is confused, but yeah. We'll keep enraged. Deal this to ourselves. We deck out. Man, Mysterio builds some crazy turns with the, uh, like, putting them at the bottom, and then you just deck out and deal yourself another card. Ooh. So we got Enraged, X, Rogue, beautiful, Armor, 2, 4, Creole Charmer, 5, and Thief Skill. Oh, my goodness. Rogue. 
We've got mental detection. We'll hang on to that. Uh, and then power of the mind, Dazzler and Machine Man. She gets a fancy new card. We're going to be resolving so many encounter cards. Oh, my goodness. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Don't don't worry, any everybody. Don't panic. Okay. Start out by adding two thread here. So we're at, uh, we're at, oh my goodness, eleven. So let's go to thirteen. Thirteen out of twenty. Com uh, Mysterio is attacking. We'll have Sunfire step in. So it's going to be two plus zero. Mysterio is confused. We'll deal out encounter cards. We have five encounter cards. What's the worst that could happen? We got an assault. Mysterio is attacking us. We are at full health. He's going to hit us for two plus a boost card. We'll take it right to the face. Plus two. That's four. We got a deepest fears. Discard cards from the top of your deck equal to the number of cards in your hand. If one identity specific card was discarded this way, place one thread on the main scheme. If no identity specific cards, so four. We got one, two, three. For our Flurry of Blades is, so we have to place one thread on the main. That's a 14. Good thing I held on to that mental detection. Yikes. Okay. Remy has got three cards. First one is a Shifting Apparition. Next one is a Deja Vu. Uh, choose to either take one damage or place one threat on the main scheme and shuffle this into any player's deck. Go there. Shuffle into Psylocke's deck. She can actually take damage. And last is an advance. Oh, no. We got two. Plus two is four. We got... We survive. We survive. Uh, we have 15. We add four. We go to 19 out of 20. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Alrighty. Well, that's kind of exciting. Actually, I think this advance is in here. And the master plan is not. Whoo! Okay, so we have we have to take care of some threats. Oh my gosh. Pass this over to Remy. We'll play Rogue. Let's use um, X Bunker to draw a card, which is Energy Sphere. Really hard not to play that on Cosmo right now. Um, I think we're going to heal for take this up to five or take us up to seven. That just gives us a lot more comfort. Um, we're going to use Thieves Guild, Creole Charmer, and Gambit's Guild Armor to play Professor X. We're going to confuse Mysterio when we do that. We're going to flip up the hero farm. Moira is going to draw us a card into Spider Girl. We're going to use Enrage to play Energy Spear on Cosmo. We're going to get a counter. Does Psylocke have anything that I can call on to deal some damage? I don't, I really don't want to shuffle a card into my deck. I could, I need Professor X to be thwarting. I can't, I can't not let Professor X thwart. Um, we're going to go ahead and thwart for five with Rogan X.
We may just have Cosmo not attack. We have the Gambit staff to clear here. I think I think that's what we're gonna have to do. Um, okay. We need to figure out how to get mental detection. We need to figure out how to get uh we can just we can just use both of these to flip into the knives. To play Machine Man. We'll use Power of the Mind to play Mental Detection. Remove one, three, five. We've got a basic activation here to take this down to six. Machine Man, mm, there's no reason in taking that out. Oh, Scimitar will trigger here, deal three damage. Because he is confused. We'll flip down to Betsy. We'll trigger Training Regiment to go grab a training card that I don't care about, which would be... Psionic Training. And we will use uh, Psionic Training and Dazzler to pump Machine Man full, and we're going to hit... Uh, the main here for three. Okay, I feel a lot more comfortable there. And we're going to stand up. I think at this point, we probably, depending on what we draw, could be ready to just push. Um, I mean, we have a really, really excellent lineup. We're full of charge counters. Uh, we don't need Spider Girl. Um, yeah, I think, I think we'll be... We'll feel pretty good. She may lose damage. Okay. Everyone stood up. Yep. We've got Wolverine, Block and Load, Melee, Molecular Acceleration, two, four, five, Aggressive Energy. I was really, really, really hoping to grab a Royal Flush. Betsy has got six. We got Telepathic Suggestion, Professor X, Psionic Redirect. Deal that to ourselves. Cerebro, two, four, five, six. We don't have any of the attack cards here. We may actually just hang out a turn. Just build, build, build. But, yeah. We'll add two. Actually, we decked out, so we will add three. We got to add the acceleration token. Okay. Mysterio is attacking us. We'll block with X. He's got two plus three. That's enough to knock X. Siri just told me that 2 plus 2 is 5, so that's good. Turn the volume off over there. Um, and then Gambit Staff is going to knock the Apparition. We're confused over here. We'll pass out cards. Gambit has got Shifting Apparition. Uh, we got Deja Vu. We'll take... No, we'll add a threat. We will shuffle this into Betsy's deck. And we've got a Fear of Kang. You cannot attack Kang. We can discard a random card from your hand to discard this obligation. Oh, it's on the top. Yikes. Cool. Uh, we'll take a charge counter. We will go Molecular Acceleration, Melee, and Lock and Load to play Wolverine. Yeah, we'll just have Rogue take out the Shifting Operation. We'll shuffle this card into our deck. Like, we, we can't pass on this much damage, I don't think. Um, oh! Oh, 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 oh. Cosmo is going to attack Mysterio and name Treachery. 
Nice. That was fun. Okay, so that was one, two, three, four. Wolverine will hit him for four. Take him down to one. No, oh, that was really fun. I enjoyed that a lot. Um, I, uh, does anything super bad happen? Discard the top five cards of each player's deck when we reveal. It's not the end of the world. And I feel like we we have we have stuff to do over here with with Betsy. So we might as well, or we we just leave them at one. We'll uh, we'll flip down and we'll go ahead and Creole Charmer. Um, <laughs> we'll get rid of the three. Okay. We have aggressive energy. We're gonna hang on to that, and Betsy's turn. So Betsy over here. We're gonna training regiment to grab a skilled investigator. We may just use that for money, honestly. Um, X Bunker will draw us into a weapons training. Oh, that's a nice card for next turn. Um, we'll heal for three. Sonic Redirect will play Cerebro. We'll use Cerebro to go grab Blindfold. Okay, we'll flip up to Psylocke. We will Psy Knife, Psy Knife for weapons training. We will Crisis Verted Telepathic Suggestion and Deadpool to play Professor X. Confused material. X will take this down to one. We got a skilled investigator over here for... Remy. Oh, wait, hold on. Nope. Moira. Flurry of Blades. Okay. I'm good with that. Play Skilled Investigator. We're going to get rid of Blindfold. We're going to hang on to Flurry and stand up. Because I think... Oh, uh, no, we're not going to have Machine Man pump right now. Just because... I want to have him at one, and I think we'll be able to one turn kill him next turn. Especially because I think we have a couple of Royal Flushes coming. Okay, stand up, stand up, stand up. Everyone up, everybody up. We've got six cards for Remy. We got Creole Charmer, Clobber, Charge Card. One by one, two, four, five. Come on, give me that Molecular Acceleration. I wanted a, I wanted a Royal Flush. Okay. Psylocke, we're going to keep Flurry. We've got Power of the Mind, Telepathic Suggestion, and a Flurry of Blades. Alrighty, that's exciting. Let's add three. We're going to get attacked over here. X is going to jump in front of that attack. Oh, wrong deck. And we're confused. Pass out encounter cards. Remy has got deepest fears. Discard cards from your deck equal to the number of cards in your hand. It's going to be all my royal flushes. One, two, three, four, five. Ah, six. Okay. If at least one identity specific card, we place a threat. And over here, we've got body swapped. Oh, flip each of our psychotanas. We can discard one psionic card as an alter ego action. Mm. Okay, well, we'll have to figure out how to deal with that. Let's pass this over here. What's the easiest way to deal one damage? I guess we could go Machine Man.
Uh, before we do that, let's actually have X Bunker draw Clobber over here. Yep, we'll have Machine Man just push Mysterio. So when revealed, discard the top five cards of each player's deck. One, one, two, three, four. And I think we actually draw a card, right? When you would draw or discard an encounter card from your deck, deal it to yourself as a face down encounter card. Draw a card. So I think we actually have aggressive energy in our hand. And then we discard energy. Okay. And discard one, two, three, four, five. And then Mysterio 3, oops, Mysterio 3 is going to come in with 32. All righty. We are going to make a basic attack and we're going to interrupt and flip this to a side knife. Deal two. The reason we're doing that is because now Flurry of Blades can hit. Yeah. Go Power of Mind and Telepathic Suggestion to play Flurry of Blades. Um. Deal two, four, confuse. Okay. Scimitar will deal three. We're going to trigger weapons training to stand everything up. Uh, I really wanted, I need a mansion. Because I have an extra card here. And I don't think I have any way to give her that card. Uh, I'm not going to discard weapons training, I guess. For some reason, I thought I was going to be able to pay for it, but I'm not going to be able to pay for it. How very sad. Okay, well, that is what it is, I guess. We will we'll flip down to Betsy. Um, yeah, cool. Okay, Remy. We have got options. We're going to flip up to Hero Farm. Moira is going to draw us into a genius. I'm going to grab a charge card. We're going to Molecular Acceleration Clobber. So we get a charge counter. We're going to spend three charge counters to change that to six damage. Here. And then it's the first card that we played. So we'll pop it back to our hand. We'll use a genius for a charge card. We'll spin three to deal. Uh, oh, wait, actually, um, clobber was seven because confused. So here's seven, eight damage. We have so much damage. <laughs> um, I probably could have gone a little bit quicker. Or earlier, but here we are. We'll go aggressive energy. Aggressive energy for clobber. We'll go ahead and spend here. So this is going to be five, eight, nine. Okay, so we have eight, so we're going to start counting up just because that's always fun. Then we got critical charmer one by one for clobber for three. 
And then we've got uh, five, nine, um, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 more damage. Um, jeez. So, yeah. So, uh, 18 damage over. Not too bad. Not too, too bad. Not bad at all. Um, yeah, that was, that was, uh, that was the Gambit's flow like a butterfly boot camp combo against Mysterio. Um, yeah, we came pretty close to the main scheme there for a little bit. I mean, the, the flow like a butterfly is such a good card. Combine that with a boot camp. We actually only ever did one superpower training as a side scheme because we could have had X jet or boot camp where the supports that we're going to trigger over here. And we don't have a ton of supports like X Bunker or Cerebro or something. We didn't have Cerebro early. Like, we didn't get a lot of our stuff online. But once we got that float and once we got the boot camps out, I mean, we just kind of zoomed through those hit points. So, probably could have just focused on one of the two. But I just wanted to see how it goes. But that is Gambit and a Psylocke team up. Hope you all enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. Peace.